Nightmares in my head, I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper Anxiety, filling up every space, no privacy And silently, it could build and build until you finally see Whoa, it's taking over, damn no closure, moving closer no exposure, I just wanna be a loner uh, Some can't stay sober, looking over all their shoulders Like moving boulders just to get out of the home It sucks, I've had enough, I don't wanna feel the stuck Under the rug, all my problems that I shove I got nightmares in my head, I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper I got nightmares in my head, I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper I've been feeling weird, I can't seem to focus good enough Nothing's really clear, sometimes it could be a little tough I just need to feel like the end's inside for me But let's be really real, anxiety can foggy all this stuff I've been feeling weird, I can't seem to focus good enough Nothing's really clear, sometimes it could be a little tough I just need to feel like the end's inside for me But let's be really real, anxiety can foggy yeah. all this stuff And now that I'm under the tree it stops. Get out from under the tree, it starts pouring. <laughs> okay. You remember my bride. Hello. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Walking in the yard. Grave yard. Any spirit who wishes to speak may leave their name information on this here device. Does anybody here need the light? Did anybody here see the light? Is anybody here stuck in limbo? Frankie. Frankie Strong. Olivia. Say your name. Can you hear my voice? Say it aloud. What did you die of, please? This is a kind of noisy place sometimes. A weather from the crypt. Oh, the weather. Today's weather. Right now it's uh, 89. It's going to go up to 90. And it's partly cloudy. Of course, there's a slight breeze, which I'm enjoying. <laughs> Thank you, miss. Any spirit who wishes to speak may speak now. Any spirit. What do you want to tell the world? Brenda. Brenda. Can you hear us? Brenda Sergeant. Did you see Jesus? Mr. Newman. Mrs. Newman. Did you see Jesus? Did you see the light? That they all speak about. Patrick, Patrick Clark. Did you see, did you see your body being laid here? 
1927. Did you want me to tell your family that you're okay? Speak. Michael, you died in 1951. You're only two years old. Did you grow up in heaven? Are you fully grown now in heaven? Were you able to come back? That's a question I'd like answered. Some psychics say you can come back after 40 years. Mr. Van Prague. Is that true? Can you come back after you've passed away? Can you come back? A simple yes or no. Any spirit here who wishes to speak, please speak now. Casey Young. You died in 1965. What did you die of? Can you hear my voice? Very simple, very easy questions. Were you able to go to your family's residences after you died? And how long after you died were you able to go? Right away? Did you see your funeral? Emma. Emma. You died in 1925. Are you still around, Emma? Emma Parker, can you hear my voice? Please do leave your name. Leave your name and number. I shall call you back. I'll return here and we shall opine. If you want to leave your name, it's much easier for me. I heard a noise over here. Ritter. Who did this? Vandalism? I know it was vandalism, but I want to hear you say it. Was it vandalism? Beautiful statue like yours. Okay, we're gonna leave. So leave your information now. Do you remember being buried here? Because it's been 1955 is when you were buried. Jesse, can you hear us? 1982, you died. Say the name on the tombstone. Trying to keep it simple today. Did you see your own funeral? Do you still, after all these years, visit family members? Is there a heaven that you go to? Do you actually leave the earth? Or are you still here?
I'm not saying nothing so I can hear you. Say the name on your tombstone and I will tell your family whether you're okay or not. You have a very beautiful grave set up. I see you are a believer in Jesus Christ of Nazareth and Blessed Mother Mary. Did you see Jesus when you crossed over? Kamichiwa. Gloria. You died uh, just in 2001. Gerald died in 1981. Gloria, did you see Gerald when you crossed the OVA? Was anybody here murdered? I see your baby, 1938 to 1938. Vera, did you grow up in heaven? Was Vera given the opportunity to come back to earth? as a human being. You are a beautiful spirit. Oh, sorry. What? Yeah. Maria feels led to come over here. So there might be a spirit. Constant. Constant Victoria Braddock. She died in 1983. Can you hear us? Remember, any spirit may answer. Any spirit here see the light. Any spirit here needs the light. I'm a hundred big intriguing quadrillion percent sure the spirits can hear me. We do live on after life. I have proven that. At least to myself. Was there any spirit here that was murdered? That's unfair. What's the name on your tombstone if you were murdered? Or if do you know the person's name who murdered you? Uh, I like uh, these people who think they're on a racing car track. One thing I want to make clear for all that's watching, if I point like this, that sight, and I'm looking at that grave, and I see that grave, and I go over to it, and I ask a question. Right here. Hazel. And you hear something negative being responded. It doesn't mean it's that grave. It could be a grave from all the way down there. It can be. It's not necessarily that Unless they say their name. Hazel, did you see Jesus of Nazareth? Are there angels? Do we have a guardian angel? All right, we're leaving now, so you might want to leave your information here on this machine. It's called a recorder.
I'm not playing games. This is uh, fact and reality. Any spirit here who wishes to leave their name, do so. Reverend. Did you see Jesus of Nazareth, Reverend? I believe in the Bible. I believe that Jesus is real. I believe that uh, there is an afterlife. Did you see a light when you died? Jasmine died in 1942. Can anybody hear us? I know there are spirits. I can't hear it in real time, usually. Sometimes I do, though. Miss May. Ali May. Did you, can you hear my, my voice? Here lies the body of Ruth Jones, born in, in 1893 and died in 1974. Ruth Aura Jones, can you hear my voice? Okay, we're leaving now. Where can they see your photographs that I see you taking on Instagram? What's the name of it? It's called uh, Cemetery Arts. Cemetery Arts. Our other site is called The Guitar Temple on YouTube. On Instagram, also called the Guitar Temple. It's not the same thing at all. That's just me hanging around and stuff. Also, I have another one. And it's called Steel Horse RV. In those days, I put too much music to the, to the stuff and People didn't find it interesting. Oh, well, hey. Anthony, are you still here, Anthony? You know you don't know me, but do you remember being buried here? Do you remember the day? Did you see yourself being buried? Mr. Cook? Now I know I've been here once before about a year and a half ago. Uh, this is definitely haunted. I was here about a year ago and I heard a voice here. Say hello to any spirit that might be here. Did you see a light when you died? Do you still visit your family members? Who is this person? Okay, we're on our way back home, so you wanna leave your name and information so I can tell your family that you're okay. Again, was anybody murdered? Were you murdered? You can tell me. We'll bring the person to justice. What's that say on there? 
Walker. It's Adrian O. Walker. 1922 2000. Wow, it has like sparkles on it. Yeah. I've never seen one like this. I know it. Ask if they've so seen the light. Don't. Okay, don't. No, you ask whatever you want. It's okay, I'll be over here. All right, come down here. Don't you? When you crossed over, have you met? Any people that were famous while when they were on this earth? Did you meet anybody famous when you crossed over? I'm talking about Elvis. Great Elvis Presley. How about John Lennon? Anybody meet him? Oh, here's the ones, Maria. Remember, I was here once before. And I said, uh, did somebody die in a fire? And you said, no fire. You were kind of perturbed. But I asked because how did one, two, three, four, and, and a mother die at one time? What tragedy happened? And you said, no tragedy. Also said that, also. 1929, what do these say in dates? Can you see them? I know. That's probably why she said that. This is the uh, baby area or something. Olivia. Olivia, I know you can speak. I can hear you a lot of the times. I heard you last year. Are you with your children, Olivia? Well, there's the Anderson family. Can the Anderson family hear me? Amber. Amber Anderson, mayor. What did you die of in 2002? Because you only were born in 1980. So you were just very young. What happened? Did you see any angels when you crossed over Amber Anderson? Mayor. You're only 22 years old. Did you die in a car accident? Was it a medical issue? Say your name, Amber, if you can hear me. And I will tell your living family members that you are okay. Anybody here? Say your name. Well, those socks, the ones that, those aren't the new socks, are they? No. Oh, okay. Bought some uh, socks that were not fitted. I got 13 inch feet. Come on. Oh yeah. The thing is, is that uh, I bought some socks. 12.6, it didn't work. So we gotta return them. It works for time. Information from the crypt. Is there a life review when you pass on to the great beyond? Is there a life review, as they say?
Now over here, I heard her voice. I did hear your voice. Sariot. Zariot. Zariot. Sariot. But toy, I'm back here. I know this wasn't your baby. 1952 to 1953, you would have been only two. Can you hear me, toy? Have to yell it out loud, please. Yes, I am. Are you happy? What did you die of? Are you happy? And I also heard from Linda. Hello, Linda. Say your name, Linda, so that I can tell your family members that you're perfectly fine. Were you cremated? What did you die of? Was, this, was it an accident or medical? Okay, all. It's been a pleasure. We come in absolute peace. Absolute peace. We come in absolute peace. We're not out to ridicule. We're not out to judge. We're not out to... Uh, antagonize we're not out to uh, say anything except for holy cow here comes a train so listen I'm gonna go now because you won't hear a thing neither will I so bon voyage and take the train to South Tallahassee all you need for a horror movie is a playground full of children That's right. singing you need to make a movie, you need a playground, kids playing. Elm Street. Yeah, kids playing, and a train coming. That's what you need to make a horror movie. That's what I say, also. I hear the train coming. Can the spirits? Can the spirits hear the train? Say yes. I know you can. You can hear that from heaven. Now we're going to replace the socks. Brought to you by Crips Graves and EVP. And there's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you stayed for the whole thing. It was a long one this time. The last time it was very, very hot and I hardly heard any spirits, to be honest. It was very difficult. Sometimes they're there, sometimes they're not. Glad you could join me. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Subscribe because uh, I just put them up whenever I choose to. I just, all of a sudden you'll get one in three days. All of a sudden you'll get one in four days. Sometimes you'll get one in seven days. So subscribe so it'll prompt up and you can click on it and say, hello there. Um, do like and subscribe press the share button okay right over there press the share button you got to share it uh, do uh, do know that you can donate below and I do uh, very much appreciate uh, the the uh, people who donate uh, and uh, tip in the tip job because there's a lot of gas that's involved <laughs> you know I drive uh, something that's equivalent to a German Tiger tank it's not just a little uh, thing I got to tow that also so listen uh, I wanted to say thank you to the uh, special people out there. Uh, all of you, I appreciate you very much. Rachel, thank you for the donation. Uh, I thank you for the tip. I got Gamma, the riverboat captain. We salute you. Always nice. Michael, good to see you. You remember my bride? Hello. And I will say we get... Uh, 
some people from Virginia watching. Hello, hello there. Marianne, that's right. Let's see what the weather is from the crypt. What's the weather from the crypt, miss? Uh, right now, it's uh, currently 89 degrees and it's uh, slightly cloudy. It's gonna go up to 93 degrees today. Is it windy? Slight <laughs> breeze. Slight breeze. As you can see there. Uh, yeah, so this this here right over here George Otto This man I had asked him I says you must have been a wealthy guy and uh, This man was the owner of a store just down the road down here supermarket Just down there his son is buried there also died in his 20s If you can believe it died in his 20s and uh, he was a brother in the church. So uh, we salute you there, uh, Mr. Otto. Always nice. And there's a guy walking his dog coming this way. That's okay, he does it every day. I see him all oh, the time. Dude. Sure, we say hello, hello there, sir. He says hello to you. Oh. Yeah. Let's go for a walk down here. Don't chill. There was a, a, a person that, the place that we're staying at, I can't remember where it is. I don't believe it. Uh, this is basically the addendum, if you will. The Because uh, the first one wasn't that many. It was so hard to hear. Uh, this one, this video, incredible. This, this video had a lot of spirits. Oh yes, right over here. Right over here, yeah. Bridget. I looked up her address and I went to her house where she had physically died, physically went there. It's no longer there, Bridget, because you died in 1941. And since 1941 to the year 2023, that house is gone. Yeah, it's, it's for, the property's for sale actually. Totally. It's vacant, nothing on there. Yeah, beachfront property though. It is. Her husband was a, uh, Jesus, I gotta tell you, I think she was a, he was a riverboat captain. I'm not joking either. <laughs> yeah, he was some type of um, riverboat, uh, not riverboat, but uh, ocean ocean cap captain or something like that. Hello, sir. Remember, we love airplanes. We love trains. This way, nobody can hear nothing. Wow, well, I love trains in Switzerland, but not in New York City. Yeah. It's nice the over there. Here. We haven't been there yet, but uh, I've been to the New York trains. <laughs> yeah, you remember the station remember station. the time? Uh, you know, uh, do you know? Oh, by the way, uh, do do spirits speak? If they don't have a voice box, how can they speak? When I'm walking around like this, the crackling, the movement uh, of the uh, trees just slightly, um, uh, ocean water, uh, a breeze of any uh, sort or anything like that, or even just walking a little bit, like that. This manipulates the wavelength, I believe. It isn't a guess now. I'm a musician, you pluck a string. That frequency, that plucking of the string will continue forward forever. It'll continue because they have heard a speech from 1941 in the year 1985. They heard it. They says, oh, where's that coming from? They says, it's coming from the moon. Because the frequency will continue. It hit the moon, bounced back, back and came back to the earth. A frequency. Guitar, you pluck it, it continues forward. So what you say will ring forever, won't it? Well, I remember, do they talk? I know for a fact they do. They definitely talk, the spirits, for sure. Remember that time in Boston? I think it was in the winter time. There was a church and uh, they were carrying down a casket, six people. And it was like this, from the top of uh, where the church was, the staircase was like that. And it was icy. So they're coming down and one of them lost their grip. And that casket hit 
the staircase and went down literally came down wicked fast right there at the bottom of it was a parked car which was on a hill and it banged into that parked car turned like a sled I'm telling you and it went down that hill like a toboggan if you will it went way down that hill and it smashed into the doors of a pharmacy bang it opened the doors and went right up to the counter the casket popped open the body flew uh, flew out of it and uh, the, they said that the body said uh, to the girl behind the counter do you have anything to stop this coffin you see it's a pharmacy but uh, yeah boom boom <laughs> you should put a sound there yeah like a funny boom anyway uh yes uh, no they're real this is as real as it gets by the way no doubt about it no getting around it every time uh, i hear it it's just incredible so today it's just to uh do an end video uh we went up there and uh i am uh yes got my socks on there they are want to dress well for the uh, people who uh, were before I'll tell you that this last time that we were here right incredible it was just an amazing thing by the way we try not to step on the graves as best we can we uh, do not antagonize we do not do Ouija boards okay good people we don't uh, screw around with that stuff and all right so do back do come back and see us and I hope to uh, opine leave a message say hello bye bye take care forgot to mention gonna go back into Walmart pick up some food it's a nice delight I forgot to mention see Good. pick up some memory pills anyway I forgot to mention the reason why uh, I want you to uh, share the videos if I can get to a thousand uh, uh, just get to a thousand uh, subscribers then I can do a live live a live show I'm gonna go up there to Walmart remember Maria there she is do they have I think so it's worldwide and you ask uh, you could ask Rachel or Gemma, 15 miles from each other. Do you have a Walmart up there? Taking you shopping. Oh, yeah. It's Greek. Because she's Greek. She never wanted love to fail. She always hoped that it was real. Look me in the eyes and said, believe me. Then the night would turn to day and there's nothing left to say. There's nothing left to say that something's wrong. Whoa, tonight you killed me with your smile. So beautiful and wild. So beautiful and woe tonight Kill me with your smile So beautiful and wild Beautiful and wild And the hands would turn with time She'd always say that she was mine She turned and walked away And said she's leaving in a whisper she'd arrive and dance into my life Like a music melody, a lover's song Whoa, tonight you killed me with your smile So beautiful and wild, so beautiful and wild So beautiful and wild, beautiful and wild. And 
In the darkest night Comes the brightest light It's deep inside So beautiful and wild Beautiful and wild Plan, I'm not evaluated That's how I end up 